Nicolas Cage went through a rough time financially, but now he's officially out of debt. This happened after decades of reckless spending where he wasted his entire $150 million fortune. Where he spent money on things like this $412,000 dinosaur skull that was stolen and he had to return it, $207,000 on this octopus scene here, $300,000 on these two poisonous cobras that he wanted to breed and couldn't, $500,000 buying severed and shrunken human heads. And he also spent an estimated $8 million on comic books, which were determined not to be a good investment. And those are just little things where he ended up spending $70 million buying yachts, private jets, castles and an island. And he wasn't paying taxes on those properly where he ended up with a tax debt to the IRS of $6.5 million. And to make it worse, his opportunities were going down where people weren't paying him for big budget movies anymore. In the 2000s when he was at his prime, he was making $20 million a movie. In the late 2010s, desperate to pay off his tax debt, he was doing roles for as little as $50,000. To pay off his tax debt, he ended up doing five to eight direct to streaming movies every year. It worked out for his benefit where some of the movies like Pig were popular and helped to reboot his career. So now he's debt free and proud of his lower budget movies.